everybody and we're back you know I haven't got to show up with my two belts yet but now I'm here so as you saw at SummerSlam I did beat Ryan like I did to him at Beast Time Mania and we all thought of it everybody was counting on me to get it and I did and people are saying that JR helped me I didn't need his help either way I would beat him and pin him clean like I did before but Look at me now. I'm on the top of the mountain. I'm the Cruiserweight Champion, but the WWE Champion, and I'm happy that I am because I deserve it, unlike Ryan. Do you know what he did while being champion? If he defended it back then when he was, I would have already been the WWE Champion, and, what, and I would have probably been the longest reigning WWE Champion. And JR, let me get it started with you. So, you returned and then beat me up, but then beat him up. But I don't get I don't get it because it does not make sense. When you were here before, you turned heel. You were tag teaming with him in the Fatal Four Way. He actually helped you win. But that's that, but that does not mean I'm trying to go on his side. And um you returned attacked him. Why would you attack him if he was the one helping you? But then you return you try to be a cocky Ryan like he was. But that did not work out. It was not your year. You was not winning matches like I was. I always was. Actually, I beat you. And I, my future was being the WWE Champion. But look at me now. I am the WWE Champion. And all you gotta know is, anybody that'll face me for these champions, I'll beat real quick. So... Anybody can come out right now and fit. Wrestler, I'll give you your props. You look good with those two champs. I'm surprised you're holding them. But there's one thing I do have to say, and there's one thing I will dang sure admit. You did not beat me. You know, there was a person. What's his name? JR. He interfered in the middle of our SummerSlam match. He attacked me brutally. And you took advantage. You took advantage of that. And then what did you do? You pinned me. I couldn't do anything in that situation. I was lost. I screamed after that match. And I thought about it for hours. On how you did not defeat me. How you will never defeat me. <laughs> you know, if there's one thing I least expect, it was my heavyweight champion being taken by you. I'm flabbergasted that you even were able to take it from me. But you know what? I will be getting that title back real soon. And I will, I will be getting my rematch. That's whether you like it or not. So you're telling me what to do, huh? Listen, you are one of the people. You are one of the people that said that. JR did not help me. Either way, I would have beat you, like I said before. Hm. We watched the match, Chance. You didn't do anything in that match. You did not do a single thing in that match. I was carrying that match on my back. What the heck did you do? A backflip, a backflip, some cartwheels, some punches? And you thought that was it? 
I even was able to cut a promo during the match. That shows how trash you are. You're really nothing. Titles or not, I still see you the same way I always saw you. But the thing that I did at SummerSlam, it was amazing because I captured this WWE champion. And now I am a WWE champion and I'm on the top of the mountain. If there's one thing I could say, every championship match I've contended in, I always beat my opponent by myself. Because you never defended it. I did, actually, against you too. And I beat you. But unfortunately, at SummerSlam, you were able to beat me. And that's because of JR. JR. You had no idea how angry I am at you. You seriously show up in the middle of my SummerSlam match? And what do you do? You attack me. You attack Chance Arrow. And you make the match what was great to nothing. You were in the shadows for so long that you come out of nowhere. It was, I was blinded. And you attack me with a steel chair? <laughs> JR, if you're here right now, if you're in the back of that locker room, I swear to you, if you came out, I will beat the mess out of you. And on to you. Don't let those titles sit on your shoulders too comfortably. Comfortably, cause sooner or later, it's coming back to me. You know what? I do agree. Jr. is fake, but he didn't. He didn't. Need to. He didn't. But he is fake. But Jr. You think it scares me watching those matches, putting on those glitches? Are you kidding me? You think it scares me? I am not scared of you. You are the person that I faced before. And that person is weak and fake. To tag along, JR, I've always seen what you're capable of. I've always seen JR in you. This dark side, <laughs> it's not going to make you any better. You know what? You think you're something because you come out at a summer sand match and attack us, blindsided, while we're already weak? Well, guess what? Guess what, JR? It's gonna be game over sooner or later. I already see the glitches. <laughs> Come on, I dare you. Come on. Come on. Come on. We're waiting. Chance! Look! What the? and you leave! Chance, wherever you are, wherever JR took you, this will be mine sooner or later. I 
wouldn't fly wouldn't do what I wouldn't even shy wouldn't help 